next year. Okay. <laughs> we're all in the plan. <laughs> okay. All right, back to the police. <laughs> City, City of Hamtramck proclamation in recognition of National Police Week. Whereas the brave men and women of law enforcement put their lives on the line every day to ensure the safety and security of our communities. And whereas National Police Week provides an opportunity to honor the service and sacrifice of these dedicated public servants. And whereas we recognize the ultimate sacrifice made by those officers who have given their lives in the line of duty and offer our condolences to their families and loved ones. And whereas we acknowledge the bravery, dedication, and professionalism of all law enforcement officers who work tirelessly to keep our community safe. And whereas we pledge to support our law enforcement officers and work collaboratively with them to address the challenges facing our communities. Now, therefore, I proclaim the week of May 14th, 2023 through May 20th, 2023 as National Police Week and call upon all citizens to join me in expressing our gratitude for the service and sacrifice of our law enforcement officers and in reaffirming our commitment to work together to create safe and thriving communities for all. Signed, Mayor Gallup, Mayor Pinterest. Thank you. Right. And do we have an award? That yes, uh, Chief Fair. All right. Thank you. A mayor and council. So part of police week includes recognizing our employees for their hard work and dedication to our community. Every year I ask the supervisors to nominate an employee that they believe stands out by their actions, work, and for recognition as employee of the year. As always, several good candidates are nominated and it's very difficult to select a recipient. This year we chose an officer and a dispatcher to be selected as recipients. Um, we have officer Christopher Fay. Um, Whereas in this officer has been a dedicated member of the Hamtramck Police Department. He has served as a field training officer for the past few years. He has volunteered to assist the department with recruiting efforts and remains a positive voice in the agency. He steps up and assists with training needs in the department. He has dedicated himself to the Hamtramck Police Department with honor and hard work. The Hamtramck Police Department gives great thanks to Officer Christopher Fay for his service. Hold on, slow motion. Oh, slow motion. Yeah, slow motion. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Thank you. And uh, this year we also have dispatcher Mark Collins. Mark Collins has been a dedicated member of the Hamtramck Police Department. As a dispatcher, he is often the first contact the person has with the police department. He interacts with the community in a positive and respectful way. He has taken several roles in the dispatch center, such as training, scheduling, keeping track of supplies, and mentoring of new dispatch employees. He has dedicated himself to the Hamtramck Police Department with honor and hard work, and the Hamtramck Police Department gives thanks to him for his service. Thank you. And just a real quick, there were other employees that were also nominated, and I do want to give them a little bit of shout out. We had Sergeant Fidenis, Sergeant Jokai, Detective Gonzalez, Detective Allison, and our crime analyst, uh, Andrew Robinson.